Hi everyone, welcome to Ferrera Apiary. I'm going to do a little uh, video on installing a uh, package of bees. And this is just my method. There's different ways. This works for me. It's quick and uh, you can do a bunch of uh, installations in pretty quick. Now I've installed five uh, packages of bees in 30 minutes maybe. So basically the, the first thing you need to do is uh, have your hive set up. I like to have a hive feeder inside and the way I always do is I make sure to have the hive set up with the feeder with feed uh, one to one syrup inside already ready for the bees. You don't want to be doing that after you install the bees, okay? So if uh, Lucas comes a little closer you can see that there's syrup already and uh, and then basically what I do is I have if you have some built up frames uh, with uh, with built drawn comb it's good I like to put these closer to the uh, feeder as possible um, and uh, basically that's where they're gonna start working and bringing the feed uh, to start uh, building up more comb the next thing I like is I like to use an empty deep box as a funnel I use it as a funnel that way when you shake the package in the, the, the empty deep box works as a funnel and it, it helps keep most of the bees in. The next thing you need to do is uh, get the, your queen out and the way I do it is I like to first of all you got to take this uh, piece of wood out you're going to need that and then I like to loosen up this staple in here if you're using these type of boxes on one side just like that so the next thing I like to do is to after removing that piece of wood right here keeping it nice and handy make sure you have a flathead tack like this because you're gonna need that and that make sure you have a nail uh, or something to pull out the cork on the queen cage okay so as you see I removed the, the one side of the staple right there just be careful not to hurt yourself on that and basically what it does it keeps the queen from dropping down into the bottom of the of the of the box all right so now you shake them off a little bit don't go crazy and you get these can out and the can can be a pain in the neck sometimes you get the can out okay and put the can off to the side and remove remove your queen cage usually I just grab it by the plastic and you got to do it quick because you're gonna need to put that back on like that okay so put your package off to the side and check your queen cameraman come a little closer you're gonna check your queen and make sure that your queen is in good shape some people like removing the attendants, I never do, never had a problem with that. The important thing now is to make sure there's two ends here. There's a cork on this end, there's a cork on that end. You do not want to take this cork out on the opposite side of the candy. Because if you take that cork off, what happens is then your queen is going gonna, is gonna to come out right away. You want to look for the sugar side and then that's the cork you take out. Okay, take the cork out and you have sugar still capping it. What I like to do is carefully use my nail and make a little hole by twisting slowly and tiny little hole, make sure you're looking and right now my queen is on that side. I don't want to impale the queen and do this slowly by turning the nail and just making a little, little, in, a little hole like that, okay? Once you did that, you take your queen, okay, you take your, your cage and your queen, and that's going to go between the frame, okay? Make sure it's not flat like this. You don't want it to be flat against the frame because then you cut the, the you know, the air. You want it to be sideways so she can still be fed and, and vent and all of that. So, get it in there, 
and then I use my tack like this okay and you can see and then it's in between okay now you have a space there so here we go back off a little bit so now shake your bees once again and this is when you're going to shake shake your bees down into the box okay use the corners like that that, make a ball and shake them off. Okay. And this is the shake method of installing a package of bees. Okay. Then you can go put this in front because the rest will fly in hopefully. And you can see most of the bees have gone inside. Okay. Now you can tap that. Off to the side, and there you go. Now, gently, now my hands gonna get all puffed up. All right, so here we go. So now you finish putting the frames back on, and and that's it. So now they're gonna go over to the queen, they got feed, and in four days, you need to come back and check, make sure that the queen has been released. If not, you have to release her, but well, most likely, she will be released. And you're all set. Very simple process, very quick, and that's all you need to do. All right, guys, thanks again for watching the video. I hope this helps you. Don't forget to subscribe and like our videos, and we'll talk to you soon. Bye bye.